Look at all the babies. I don't see Scooter here. Oh yeah, you're over there. You're looking for yours, aren't you? Yeah. Anyway, okay. Mild up tonight. She's she's almost 70. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Here. Delivery. <laughs> Delivery. Okay, here. Alright, there you go. There you go. Yes. I went to see Jurassic Park today. And uh, I'm a big fan of Jurassic Park movies. And I enjoyed it. It was one of the better ones. So, I was surprised the number of people that were there today. Yeah. I got a hair of a hot dog, which I wasn't too impressed with. Uh, I hate that. Now the guy that was making them, he should have, he had long curly hair and he should have had a, a, a hairnet. Like when you go to McDonald's and places, they have hairnets, especially if they're dealing with food. Here. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Either wears a hairnet or, or cut his hair, something. Anyway, I threw it out. I couldn't. Ugh. That turned me right off. Yeah. What? You have to learn to come. You gotta learn to come. Get it. Look. See. Look. See. See what you do. Look. See. Now that wasn't Eric. Come on. Look. Oh. What are you doing? Huh? Where's Scooter tonight? Well, there's Sammy. There's my boy. It's a boy, yes he was. Yes he was, yes he was. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Sammy doesn't mind me. Here. Oh, uh, one of my moderators um, sent me a video of this fella. I don't know what his name is, but he, uh, I think he did the video a while ago. He was doing a, a review on, on what I was doing here. And, uh, I mean, I don't recommend, I never recommend anybody do this. I mean, it's different. I mean, I know these raccoons know me, you know, and I've been doing it for 22 years. And, uh, anyway, he... Call me an old man. <laughs> that old fella. I don't feel like I'm an old fella, but anyway, I guess I look like one. But, but he, uh, where are you going? Yeah, throw one down to him. Take that home with him. There he goes. But uh, they, he doesn't understand that the uh, we don't have rabies here in Nova Scotia, but, and the fact that a lot of these raccoons I raised from the time they were babies, so they're they're used to me. And uh, he said, uh, "Wow, it's going to take one, you know, one nasty one." And I said, "Well, I never met one yet. <clears throat> I, I mean, these guys, I don't." What are you doing? I don't find them aggressive at all. Aggressive with each other. What? There's three hot dogs in front of you. No. There's three hot dogs. Look. <laughs> There's three hot dogs in front of you. There. Oh. But he just doesn't understand the situation here. He had this uniform on. He was a, I don't know, something to do with wildlife or something or trapper. And if if you have trouble with raccoons, you call him in. And 
That's, that's what his job was, but anyway. He wasn't even, he, he says, I think the fellow lives in Canada, I'm not sure. So, here. Who's, tach, who's touching me? What are you doing touching me? Here. <laughs> you and your wet feet, I just got these clean. Buddy. Yes, you did, buddy. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. I find that, um, like, I can pet my raccoons even while they're eating, you know. Well, that's Buddy, see? He doesn't mind me. I know which ones I pet and which ones I can't. I don't know what to tell you, but you get the three hot dogs. Pick one. Uh, who's down there? Woody? No, that's not Woody. And that's not Woody because Woody grabs him and runs around the back of the house. He also showed uh, the video of the bear that was up here too. I mean, that happened two years ago. He hasn't been back here since. And that was just a, a one-off visit, really. And he said, I'm going to uh, invite coyotes here that will kill the cats. And Well, the cats don't go out. And we don't have, we have coyotes, but I, we never see them here. Never saw one yet. I've been here, I've been living here 22 years. I hear them at night in the wintertime. <clears throat> there. <laughs> I don't think we're going to go through that many hot dogs tonight. It went to about 15 pounds. Last night was an exception. Of course, I was late too. Don't take them long to dirty up the water. No. What? You good girl. What a good girl. Yes, you are here. Yeah. You ready for another one? Here. Take it. Well, take it. <laughs> Look, he's standing in front of two. What? You got two hot dogs standing sitting there underneath you. Stand it. Here. Maybe he can't see them. I don't know. He could smell them. Yep. And my friend, uh, she has a blind one, uh, I think he's 11 years old now, and uh, he keeps finding his way to her house. Here, have one in the corner. There you go. No, he didn't want it. What do you want? I'm just going to ignore you. <laughs> I'm going to ignore you. What do you want? What? They like them in the water. Here. Here. You go. Oh, Woody, come on up. No, you're not coming. There he goes, around the back of the house. We got two Woodies down there. Well, that's it for that five pounds. Bandit, look. I don't think you can see it, can you? Look. No, we can't. Okay. That's all right. I'll go get some more. Hi, Charlotte. Hi, Charlotte.
got some dry food, some cookies, and more hot dogs. No June bugs tonight, they must be done. Woody! You get it? There he goes, around the back of the house. Yeah, this guy was wondering how I got the name the Raccoon Whisper. I didn't name myself that. One of the fans gave me that name quite a few years ago now. I was doing this since 2011. And, uh, and that's how I, I got that handle and it just sort of stuck. So. But I, I didn't name myself that. that. That came from somebody, one of the fans. I'm going to put some dry out here. You ready for another one? Here. Here. You ready for another one? Here, do you want to fish it out yourself? No. You want to look it? Here. Go and get it yourself. You get it? There you go. See, I didn't have to hand it to them. I gotta hand it to this fella. Here. Poor 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 bandit. He can't see, can you? Huh? I noticed that a little while ago. Like he walked right past the hot dog. There's Woody back again. The two of them are standing up in the air. Now he'll stay there. Now there's the other Woody. And he takes it and he goes in behind the back of the house. <clears throat> what do you want, buddy? Here. Here you go. He likes his hot dog, and I'm just going to pour this out here. Pour some more here. Yeah, this, uh, well, I went in to get Kentucky Fried Chicken, and uh, the girl that was in the window, she said, uh, you're that raccoon whisper fella, aren't you? I said, yeah. And she said, she had a raccoon that was, uh, was, uh, went after her cat. And I said, well, that's not normal. I said, there must have been something wrong with him. And she said, he, uh, he chases everybody in the yard, goes after them, and, like, really aggressive. Yeah, they want cookies now. And I, here. And I said, well, he may have feline distemper. And if that's the case, I said, don't go near him and don't let any animals near him. It's not the first time we've had that here. That's a, that's a deadly disease to the raccoons. They don't last very long when they have it. <clears throat> yeah, see, they want the cookies now. Do you want? Do you want that? Okay. You want? You want to have that? Okay. Throw that in there. And you got a hot dog in there? No, you got one now. Woody's not back again. So I told her, I said, that's what you, I said, he won't be about, around very long if he has it. He'll go away and die somewhere in the woods, so. It's a hell of a disease. I know Hope for Wildlife, she had, about seven years ago, we had a bad bout of it here in the province, and uh, she lost a lot in her sanctuary that she had. And, um, I remember watching that video, 
And so she, her staff, she got them to wear, uh, they wear boots and they walk through a bath. Do you want another one of these? Okay. You don't want it? You want a cookie? Oh, excuse me. He says, the cookies are better. You want a hot dog? Look. No, he wants a hot dog. So yeah, she lost a lot of uh, a lot of raccoons that year. I was lucky that year. None of mine had it, or it would have wiped me right out too. So. But I, I have the same group all the time. Like the odd the odd time I get a wild one here, but not too often. And you can tell because they won't they won't come up here. They'll come up, but. They won't come near you. There. How's that close? Uh huh? How's that look? All right. What? You want another hot dog? Here. Throw it in the water. You got lots of dry food out. He wants a hot dog. Woody didn't come back. <laughs> I threw that one over, boy, it landed right in front of him. I got good aim. I'll throw another one down there in case Woody comes back. That's it for that's five to a seven pounds of hot dog, so that's not bad. I would say some of the mothers are um, staying home tonight, but you know, um, tonight here about, I guess around <coughs> quarter to nine when I got home, it was still daylight, and I had uh, I had Buddy here and another one. The two of them had the, the breasts, and they were here, and I gave them some hot, I gave them a pound of hot dogs split between the two of them, and I gave them a... Uh, dry food. So. You're looking for a cookie that's not broke. There you go. You found her. Yeah. Yeah, that guy that uh, was talking about me, he, he forgets about the raccoons that live in dumpsters. About healthy food and stuff, you know, but he he forgets about the ones in the city, and that's all they eat is whatever's in the dumpster, rotten old everything. But the, the raccoon is, is only what? What? What do you want? A hot dog. Well, just a minute. I'll have to get one on the floor. Just a minute. I got none. The, I got none in the jar here. Here. <laughs> I I gave them all out, but I did. I gave them all out. Anyway, I'm going to uh, take this stuff in. I think we're done here as far as feeding goes. And yeah, we're done here as far as feeding goes. <clears throat> Everybody's <laughs> every, he's opening up all the cookies and eating all the cream. What are you doing? What do you got? What do you got? What is it? Here, face the camera. We'll see who you are. Come here. Look. Look, there you go. Look at that. What a pretty picture. 
What a pretty picture. Yes. <laughs> you good boy? Are you good boy? Are you? You're just a teenager. You're just a teenager, aren't you? What are you watching? There's nobody out there. No, there's nobody out there. <clears throat> no, there's not. There's nobody there. Uh, you coming up? Come on up. Come on. Oh, I'll get out of your way. Here. There you go. Come on up and see what we got. Come see. You gonna get a cookie? Go get a cookie. Go get a cookie. What's the matter? Go get a cookie. There. <laughs> oh, there's a hot dog. There's a hot dog behind you, look. There's a hot dog right there. Oh, too late. Nope, buddy didn't want it. Well, everybody's happy. And all get full bellies again. Yeah, we all get full bellies. I want to thank some of the people that, that commented on that video they picked up for me. They must have been watching my videos. Anyway, thanks for the, the praise and the backup, so I uh, sure appreciate it. Well, I'm going to turn off the big light. <clears throat> Jeez, we got you fellas all fed early. Huh? Get you all fed early. Yeah. Now I'm going to go Charlotte. Charlotte. See if we can get her to talk. And her sign is on. <laughs> I'll get peanuts there too, I didn't put out yet. Uh, I never did use a, that machine yet. <laughs> There's the bottle that goes in it. What you doing, bud? What? Were you in the catio today? Connor? Were you in the catio? I heard you were. Were you in the catio? Connor? Were you in the catio? Were you? Were you in the catio? Oh, he's such a good boy. Oh, he's such a good boy, aren't you? Yes, you are. He's just a Connor cat. He's just a Connor cat. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Charlotte? Charlotte? You coming up? Charlotte? Where you going, girl? You coming up too? Come on up. Come on. No? Not interested. There's Jim's diner. <laughs> he had Kentucky Fried Chicken. And he had some, uh, he likes fries with gravy. No Tim Horton donuts today. No Tim Horton today. No. <laughs> Alright, we're going to get this up on the internet, I guess. And we'll let them fellas eat in peace out there. So anyway, thank you for watching, and uh, we shall see you again tomorrow night.